Okay everybody, welcome back to Shogun 2 and the uh, Scramble for the East mod. Now, uh, once again, uh, Creative Assembly decided to uh, give us a patch for the game, so I don't know if that's broken anything. It'd be rather annoying as we're only, I think, one settlement away from victory, aren't we, in this campaign? Uh, I think we're only one settlement away. They didn't actually say what the patch did. They immediately locked the thread on it. Um, so the last information on um, Shogun 2 on Steam was from the May 24th update. Yeah, very sneaky of Creative Assembly. Very sneaky. Anyway, we'll try to carry on with the campaign. One day I'm going to get a campaign where I can actually get a blasted field marshal. Right, that chap I should try to kill off, maybe. So, uh, yeah, actually two. We need Musashi. Right, Musashi should be somewhere over the rainbow. That's Izu. It should be somewhere around here, right? There it is, Musashi. Now, on the good part uh, we're now at war with the United States again uh, because they declared war on me right so I got my courtesan up here uh, we're trying to rush some troops I think we've got two armies coming up by sea and we're going to try and wipe out those blast Prussians and get back our home region uh, so that'll be one of those two and then sell somebody off over there see if any of these need upgrading because I might have missed some uh, the assassins have been getting a lot of use haven't they do I still have four assassins that's one two three four yep and Corsan's two three and four military advisors one two three one two three no, I only have three? Or am I misreading that? Military advisor, military advisor, military advisor. Nope, four. There it is. Right, any ships to move? Possibly. Yeah. Alright. That's probably worth raiding, isn't it? Just to annoy them. Right. Uh, you're up there because. Prussians and the British and probably now the Americans keep trying to raid our main port where we get pretty much uh, all of our income going through okay you're just sitting there repairing aren't you what's that ship doing um, they need some replenishment small amount I think they were there bombarding that army which managed to get all the way from somewhere down there over to there Right, you're up there guarding the port, you're guarding a port, you're guarding a port. You're trying to bombard them, but you're out of range. And you're on the uh, trade route, which isn't really bringing in much money, is it? Right, well, we're going to pick up these two regions in any case. Uh, currently, we're at peace with the British, oddly enough. Oh, sod. All right. Are you in range? Let's move him back to make sure he is in range. And you are replenishing. Okay. And we've got an army there. Why? Probably just guarding that pass. Can I put him in there and hide him? Maybe? Go on, hide. So you can ambush people. Maybe I can get you into there. So you can ambush people as well. Uh, yeah, we're actually in British territory. That might be upsetting them if they knew we were there. Anyway, we've got an army besieging Hiroshima, which will fall. They shouldn't really be getting any reinforcements because we pretty much destroyed that army. And they don't have a general, I don't believe, so they're all taking attrition. Right, let's end the uh, turn. Um, Oh, we're going to get extra replenishment. We are in winter time, but that will help. Now we need to find somewhere else to go. 
we need to go somewhere else. Oh, is she going to try to bribe our, our military advisor again? She was quite effective before. Aha. Alright. We're going to have another battle, and we're going to kill off most of those. Last time they attacked, we had a few extra regular units. There was a glitch with the armed citizenry. Uh, they actually have a European um, uh, unit card. Uh, they don't get the Japanese looking one. Don't know why that happens, but you'll see it in game. Yeah, but last time we had, I think, five extra regular units. But um, we almost outnumber them, don't we? And last time they had something like four and a half thousand troops and we beat them. So, no generals. Uh, some of their units didn't take any attrition because uh, they're elite units. Yep, might be able to kill all of those ones off. So this is being recorded uh, in the second week of June. Don't know when you'll get to see it, but there's a good chance that the campaign might be finished around about the end of June. All right. Many of the campaigns on the channel are being finished. All right. I never get the uh, mortar placements correct. But uh, we'll see. Those ones are probably facing where I want them to be. Yep, see, there's the armed citizens. Alright. Oh, we still have some damage, do we? Alright. You go over there. And then you can fill in there. Because we've got a small unit right there. Oh. Um, no, let's make them go on the corner. Yeah. There's only a small gap there. Alright. I'm fairly happy with that. Alright. Are you going to be in range? Right, now which tower is that? Nope. Mm, that's that one. We'll just get them all firing. Not sure if we ever take any friendly fire from them. Right, and who's that who's moving around? Why are you suppose? What are you doing moving? Oh, don't say it's some kind of blast glitch that's been introduced with that uh, new update. Stop moving. You're already in position. Get back to it. Yeah, they shouldn't have been moving. Alright. All of you get on guard mode. Alright. All of those are actually too close for you to hit, aren't they? Which is annoying. Engage them, indeed. So it's a big push here. Oh, those units, those are probably... No, those are cavalry. Do I have anyone guarding over there? Right. Take the arm citizenry. Get over there. Yeah, they got a bunch of units out there that I did not see. Well, oh, they were hidden. Um, Hanoverian guards, but they're all very small units. Most of those will get killed off by the towers, probably. They're trying to sneak down there. Yeah. Making a big push there. 
I mean, it does look cool where they've blasted through last time. They even blasted through the gates, didn't they? They did destroy a number of towers, I think, because they had a howitzer somewhere. And they were targeting my towers very effectively. Yeah. Mine infantry. Right, you're firing as well. They don't appear to be taking many casualties yet. I really wish we could zoom in on this. Uh, I mean, we can make it bigger, but then it just takes up too much of the screen. It's one way you can scroll in, or we can just hide it completely. Yeah, they don't look like they're taking as many casualties as before. Might as well have a close-up of some of their units. Who we got here? Hanoverian Infantry. Marching very steadily up. Württemberg Infantry. I did say that the next campaign... Uh, look at those beautiful flags. Uh, the next campaign would probably be a native Japanese one. Right. So, you're in position. I don't know what happened to that unit. I think they ran around that corner around there. Alright. Yeah, move over. Alright, wherever you are, you're not firing. At least not yet. We have a little hole where we can slot them in somewhere. Maybe just put them right there so they can fire at somebody because they're not shooting at the moment and neither are those ones those are not in range alright we've destroyed that unit still getting fired on by the tower there's another unit, Shattered. Media Foot, that's one of the unique units, I think, for the Prussian faction. Nobody appears to be in melee at the moment. Looks like we're killing off most of their units. These ones are not making a push up. In the last battle where we fought here, they really did make a big push, and they got all the way inside. Um, and they even managed to get up through here. We had a massive little fight there at the end of the last battle. And we only just managed to hold on. Alright, so I got you in position, but see, that, they're definitely moving a lot slower than they did before. I swear it. That's okay. Right, who's coming up over there? Very small units. They are being fired on by the uh, towers. See, that's that howitzer there. They don't even appear to be doing anything. Right, because uh, that gatehouse is down as well. So they can just march in. It does create a, a bit of a bottleneck, and it means I'll be getting fired on by these units as they come through. Still nobody in melee. We had to do a lot of melee fighting in the last battle here. Yeah, so much slower. Right. Yeah, they just are not making any kind of push up on there, are they? They're just not moving. I think it's got to be something to do with that um, new update. 
I mean, they are firing, but that's not really going to inflict many casualties. I mean, they got up into the walls all along there in the last battle and went into melee. And because they were all regular units, and most of mine were uh, garrison units, uh, they just destroyed them. See, look at these ones. The, they had a clear route right through there, and they've just stopped to try firing up instead of going straight in or even attacking these units in the rear. In fact, you can't even um, fire on them, can you, from there? Maybe if I get them there, they can uh, fire? Or maybe they won't. Maybe they won't have line of sight. That's just really weird. I don't think we're doing any damage out there. I mean, there's a lot of red down there, so we're definitely killing somebody. See, why aren't you pushing? You've got hundreds and hundreds of men. There's at least six units in there. Possibly more. And they could get right into the uh, town centre. Or the castle centre. Are you even firing? You're apparently still running. See, they're not even moving as quickly as they did before. They just travelled from there to there. And now they're moving again. Why? Go to where I tell you to go, please. And you still are not having to fight anyone. They're all just marching right across there and then around. It's rather stupid. Right. I'm going to put you there so you can actually fire at them as they come past. Yep, they aren't even trying in this battle. Alright, we're just going to speed it all up. See, those ones are still technically just marching. I'm going to move them over there so they have a clear line of sight. Nope, oh, at least one of them came out, but then was broken. Are you firing? No, don't. You don't really need to move forward. You can just stand there and shoot them. Are uh, they actually going to engage? They all broke, didn't they? We just got those ones moving across. Right, you over there, and please stay where I tell you so you can shoot those ones. Uh, we've broken everyone over here. There's the howitzer that's still active. Looks like it's just these units. Go on, get into position. Yeah, pathfinding was not an issue for this game or mod for me before. It appears to be now. Alright, just, just stop so you can start shooting. And then they go off moving again. What is it with that unit and wanting to go in the corner there? At least start shooting at somebody. 
Okay, now where are you going to go so you can start shooting at them? But you're not following orders, mate. You most definitely are not. Yeah, finally those ones are shattered. They can't have too many active units. Right, I'm actually going to bring that one down. Uh, they can't even get out from over here, can they? And they can't run down there. That's a dead zone. Right. Are they going to change their minds? All right, maybe they will. All right, let me send those ones down and then I'll just take that unit. You better be firing. Yeah, come on down. And then I'll send you out after those ones. They just haven't used any ammunition whatsoever. Come on now. Alright, that one's going. Uh, you're still technically moving. Again, there they go. Alright, you, come on out. You can come off for of guard mode. Come and get that blasted uh, howitzer, which hasn't even been firing. I swear it hasn't. Because last time they were blasting holes all in the walls and knocking down the towers. Right, now they want a waiver. Yeah, trying to run away. Alright, the men are running off over there. And the uh, horses are going off over there. And there's basically only one active unit I can see on the map. Somewhere around here. There he is. No, fairly large unit though. They've only lost three men. It is an elite unit. Hmm, you know all the way over there, so you know what I have over here. You want actually firing? Those are shaken. That's the garrison unit. Ah, they just shattered. That's an elite unit. I don't know if we can catch them, but you never know. Oh, there's an, another unit out here. Hidden. Right, they never fired at us. I'm certain of that. Go on, we can't go any faster. You are technically still moving the men tire, sir. They, require rest. Oh, they can rest when they're dead All right. get after them 240 militia against 200 guards units doesn't look like we're going to catch up to them. Alright, I'll pause this because we're literally at the end of the video. And we'll come back when we've got the victory. Well, there it is. Uh, continue. What if you can actually reach them? Come on, come on. 
Oh, did they suddenly they ran right through you? And you don't seem to be able to kill them because they're on the horses. All right. Now, um, actually, if you just stop, can you shoot them? Yeah, but then they're going to get out of range. Okay, there it is. It's a victory. Uh, seem to be very buggy there. Thanks, CA. Right, I mean, we literally lost 178. Everybody, all of those are auto respawn. Um, I guess that's where we lost most of the casualties from. Right. We still got 700, but they should still be taking winter attrition. Right. Now we have to go through the end turn sequence. Is the UK going to turn on us? Probably. If not now, sooner rather than later. No, oh, nobody attacked us. Oh, they just went and raided the port. And then they disappeared somewhere. Alright, let's go through those. Uh, money didn't get affected. Army distracted. Enemy raid. Yep. Our assassins are always detected. What's he going for now? Arms, science. Military advisor actions. No, not really worth it. We very rarely run out of ammunition. It does happen occasionally. Let's see if there's something better. That's all the way back there. Uh, recruitment cost. Yeah, but we literally can only get artillery from one place in any case, so I'm not really using much of that. 1% uh, movement range. Would you even notice? 2% cavalry costs. No. Accuracy of ships, advanced armor piercing shells. Uh, we don't really need that. Ooh, uh, minus two to recruitment time. Now that's actually quite good. That is. Minus four to uh, recruiting cost across all provinces. Again, we can only recruit from one province. So, not really helping much there. Right, torpedoes away. Ooh, minus three to the recruitment time of ships faction wide. And that's the one we'll go for. Uh, pretty much everything else we can do off camera. So uh, that's where we'll end this episode. And thanks for watching and liking and commenting and definitely subscribing because you should have all done that right at the beginning of the video.